Well, there are a lot of dialogues surrounding breast cancer. There's research, there's testing, there's treatment, there's survivorships. But what's been important to me, and which is why I started my advocacy work, is I'd like to see more representation in the media with different groups of people. You know, we spoke about this a little earlier on about the cultural taboos in certain cultures and our South Asian cultures. We just don't see enough people, whether it's ads on TV or whether it's these organizations. Do you realize there is no organization in the breast cancer space, nonprofit that is focused on South Asians. And so, you know, there are organizations, um, Jewish organ organizations, there's organizations for black people, there's organizations for Latino people. There is no organization for South Asians at all here in this country. And so those are not faces that you see. And just when you think about um, addressing like gene therapy, you know, is there, is there some genetic basis to breast cancer or any cancer that we have? We don't know because there hasn't been research. And so those are areas that I'd like to see addressed is that I'd like our community to step up and participate in research, clinical research, basic research, just do surveys or anything, talking about lifestyle, talking about getting support from within the community. If you can't get it from your family, can other community members, um, offer support for you. Um, you know, how do you tell your children, things like that. We just need to be out there. We need to be vocal. We need to participate. And that's a big area that I see that's, that needs to be addressed. The flip side of that, because of the work that I've done in healthcare is that large healthcare companies, pharmaceuticals and the greater healthcare um, industry sees a need for that. They have just been unable to penetrate some of these ethnic groups because of the reluctance of people, leaders coming up and talking about it and saying, yeah, it, it, it is in our community. We need to talk about it so that the next person can step up and say, I have it. I'm going to participate in research. I'm going to help somebody. What surprised me, as I mentioned, I did not tell a lot of people. The few South Asian women that I told, I was surprised how somebody would whisper to me and say, I've had that 10 years ago. Nobody except my immediate family knows. I had it twice. I just got a recurrence. I've had another type of cancer three times. I was shocked at the whispers that I got from other women, South Asian women, that said, it happened to me or I'm going through it now. I don't didn't know who to talk to. So it's out there. And the hospitals that are addressing these these the research or, or the surveys or the socioeconomic portions of it or any part of it they're just not getting enough of us to step forward and so i'd like to see that i'd like to see our community step forward so we can work together with the industry to address areas of research areas of um, fine finances areas of support or anything and we should have an organization that's dedicated for us